guys, Jazz the Gamer here. Welcome back to the next episode of Hardcore Minecraft. In the last episode, we started working on the zombie spawner, and right now we have the drop shoot, which is right here, all set to go. We just need to go ahead and finish the top, seal it off, and then take off the torches. Uh, we're gonna need this to cover the top of the spawner, and then we can come down here and see if it actually works. I did a different system to where it's funneling to one to the middle right below the spawner and then they drop down we're gonna see how well that actually works also need to make a path going up to the top Oop. so now those are all of our pickaxes I don't have any sticks so we'll have to use our diamond pickaxe for now until we get back up to the top and make some more This came right in front of it, it looks like. Just twist this way. Yeah, it did. It took us right in front of it. Fill that in, actually. Actually, ooh, we're... Take some of the cobbled and... Yeah, that's how we do it. There we go. So the gaps that we're going to fill in will fill in with this cobbled stone. Like that over there. Yeah, let's just jump over. Whoops. And we need to fill those in. Water and then water. Pushes it them. Yeah. It will push them down there. Uh, and then they will die. Yeah, that's it. By my hands. So we're going to fill this in also. And those like that. And there we go. So then now we need to go around. To here. And we need to go up a little bit higher, though. Take, oh, I'm not close enough? Okay. You need to take that torch off at the top. And that one. And then we need to place it with that. That one, that one. Can I reach that one? No. Take that one out. That one out. So, we have to make a path to get back over there to take those two off. And then this should be ready to go. Why are you here? Come from. Oh. Is there another one shooting me? Because. This guy. Oh, I went too high. Oh, we're not getting him today. Uh, yeah, let's finish this over here. We don't need to worry about that zombie. We have more than enough zombie flesh from this farm here. 
Uh, this one... Nope, not there. Oh, I could do it from this angle, couldn't I? Yeah, I could. Um, that one, that one, I can't reach that one. Still can't reach it. Oh, okay. There we go. Fill those in. And voila, our farm is ready. Put these in here. And then we'll bring our enchantment table down. And hopefully we can get smite on, on our sword. So we're up to five XP, that's good. Like. These zombie flesh we don't really need. I'm just hoping that they drop down with armor though. Hopefully drop some of the armor. What is this? Oh, the pack spawning thing. That's right. I forgot about that. Uh, so we have to spawn proof this. <laughs> uh, let's see here. That. We want to make it so that we can walk out easily. So when you attack zombies, I put that in the wrong spot, uh, more zombies spawn to come and help. It's a very annoying mechanic that they have in this game, but it's a part of the game nonetheless. So to prevent that from happening down here, we just need to spawn proof this area so that they don't basically attack. They don't spawn and attack us. Um, that, like that. This torch here. Before we start, I was ready to attack them again, but before we do that, we're going to uh, get this set up. Okay, so that part's set. So we're going to fill in those areas there. We got a bunch of those guys already waiting for us. We want to fill that in. The, that right there. Okay. Uh, that should be good. Torch here. And we may need to build this behind us. Let's put that right there. And then put that there. And then those. So that should be good there to protect us. Oh. <laughs> that did not scare me. Don't worry. Um, but they're overcrowding and killing each other at the moment. So we need to take care of that. But none of them are dropping with armor. Strangely. Oh, we have potatoes. Now we can plant our potatoes. Now we can get this out of here. 
You know what? For now, we'll just air this. Actually, I need to take that back up top. Why did I do that? And throw that in there. And that. All right, so I'm going to spend some time down here uh, killing these guys. Um, we're going to do that in a time lapse. So they're overcrowding again. It took about, I think, like two minutes for them to overcrowd. Uh, so this isn't the, the most efficient XP farm as far as getting a bunch of XP all at once. Um, when we get to the end and we conquer that, then we'll have our guardian, not our guardian, sorry, our enderman farm. And then we can get like 30 experiences in like one minute, something like that. It's a very crazy amount of time that how that can be done. Um, but we're gonna take the 16 that we have here They're still dropping like like you just want to keep killing them because you hate zombies so much. You no, know? I know I do I can't stand zombies, but anyways, we need to get back up to the top um, With this 15 XP bring that stuff down and in a way to not make it so boring We're going to build our sugarcane farm like we did the last time sugarcane farm around here. I Think we'll only do sugarcane might put some yeah we'll put the vegetables down here also and we can do all those oh it just broke good thing we made another one all of those at the same time while we have these guys fall down and then we can kill them and slaughter them put that in there all right, so i'm gonna head back up right now and like i said it should be uh easy to get up and down you know what i should probably make markers for myself maybe let's do that grab this can i turn this into a fence wall that can i do that yes and so we're gonna do this 48 fence walls should be good enough to make markers for ourselves. and there goes a marker right here <laughs> um and then we're gonna come down this way and when i get here i'll say hey guess what oh okay you won't be spawning much more after I fix this area around. So enjoy yourself, buddy. Enjoy yourself. Uh, who is... Just did that. So you shoot me and run away? Who did that? Oh, you're still here? Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh, so we are close. There goes a catalyst right there. I get XP for me, right? Look at that. Awesome. Wait, what was I doing? I was doing something else. Yeah, we're heading back up to the top. <laughs> there goes our marker. Come around this way and when we get here right here we'll say hey here's your other marker to get to the XP farm and it says it says turn right and then up here we have to make a jump Crazy jump, uh, here, and this one says turn right here, okay, and then we're up here, you put lighting down there, and it says turn right here. Come up here. 
then from here, I don't know. <laughs> um, that's our thing, that's our marker there. Let's go straight and see what we find first. Found diamonds. That one. Okay. I need to find a path that takes me up. It's not that one. Don't believe it's that one. Where did we pillared um That's a dead end. I don't think it was there. So it has to be this way. But not there. It's right here. Okay. So when we're here... So that's our marker. It says turn right. This marker says, no, not there. This marker says turn left. And then we come up here. And in this, we come here, this marker will say, hey, turn left there. And this is self-explanatory here. This one will say, I don't know what this one will say. This will just be a water chute bringing us down. Hopefully I have enough to build this, to build a thing up. What we'll do is actually put this here and it will make that, that, and that right there. And then I'll see these and these will say, hey, you need to look up. Right, okay, so that's there. Let's take a couple more of these out so we can make this a little better. Right there. And then we'll do or also, so that, that, and put that one there, and then this one right here to let us know something is up. I don't know why I built that there. And in this one, now did I come this way or the other way? That's the thing. Yeah, it was this way. There we go. And we can actually come up this way. And then around this way. And here we are at the beginning again. So you remember to get a water bucket so that we can make a water flow going down.
All right, so we made it back up to the top. It took a little longer than I <laughs> thought it would. Uh, but we're going to end the episode there for today. Whoop, whoop, there we go. Yep, end it there for today. Plant our some, uh, plant some potatoes uh, down here. Actually, we'll plant them down there. So we'll have to bring some dirt and all that with us. Uh, but we'll do that tomorrow on the next episode. Uh, on our have to get stronger um but we need to set up a food source also so i don't know if i'm going to bring cows down there that would be a lot of work i think i probably won't bring any cows down we we'll have to bring our cows up here i think all right guys thank you for joining me on this episode if you have any comments or suggestions go ahead and put them down in the comment section and until next time adios